Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Brewster's Real Ice Cream. This is a scoop above the rest, one true pint. Small batch premium ice cream made fresh on site daily. This is the cherry vanilla. And the key lime. These were $6.99 a pint, which is a great. It's good to because they fill them up. Yes, they do. So you go, they have a list of flavors, what, like 22, 22 24? Flavor, 22, 24, I think 24 there. flavors, something yeah. like that. And, yeah, it's 24 uh, flavors out of like 100 and some flavors. Yes. If so, they rotate around. Yes, and so you pick out what you want in the pint, or you can get it in a cone or... Uh, yeah, I, I think they have shakes and sundaes and cakes, cakes and pies. Yes, they have lots of stuff. That looked like a full-size cherry. It like is. Half a cherry. It is. So I've got cherry, yes. There's actual cherries in here, like maraschino cherries. Like, look, that's a whole yeah, cherry. Yeah. Literally a whole cherry. <laughs> well, they could have at least cut them in half. So I'm wondering if that's not, that's it. Like, they made vanilla ice cream and just added maraschino cherries to it. So, like, I'm going to have a bite of the vanilla first. Uh, as a vanilla ice cream lover, that's some awesome vanilla. <laughs> that's some good vanilla ice cream. It's delicious vanilla ice cream. And it's not... Because I love vanilla ice cream. Kevin does. That's not vanilla bean. Mm -hmm. This reminds me a lot of what we make homemade. Mm -hmm. Except we put... It's very sweet. We put just a little bit of the juice in the, in the ice cream itself. So it makes the whole thing a little pink. And, uh -huh. uh, and the whole thing tastes a little like cherry. This is very specifically cherry vanilla. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Have we made that for the channel? No, no, if we were, that was what mom and my mom and dad made all the time. We've done ice cream recipes for the channel. Um, mm. Gosh, that cherry's wonderful. I mean, That's literally, literally though, what they've done is they've made vanilla and put whole maraschino cherry. They've drained the juice. I don't even know if those are maraschino cherries because maraschino cherries are kind of squishy. These are firm. Like, they've been like frozen. This? They are. They are maraschino cherries. They've been frozen. I guess so. That's wonderful. I wonder how many of those cherries you get though, because like I, I have gotten I've eaten probably three or four out of here. Okay, I ate one and I don't have so they're all they're, they're all, all in there. Okay. Cause I've only eaten one and mine's gone from my ball. Yeah, look at the bottom. Mm. There's even one. Okay. Oh, uh, there's more in there. I'll get you some out for the picture at the end of the video. Oh. Kevin's gonna take care of me right now. They're so pretty. Cherries, they're such a pretty color. And I mean, they can make anything uh, bring happiness. You know, they make anything look festive. Um, the good thing about this love though, that. even though you may not get cherries in every bite, yeah. which like I said, if they come in half, they would have doubled the amount of cherries in there. They could use the same amount of cherries, just split them up so you get more each bite. That's true. That's probably what I would have done, but even if you don't get cherries, the ice cream is so good. Let me just say this though. <laughs> I do understand why they haven't cut each one of them in half. Exactly. And that's because they're making it fresh on site. Can you imagine having to go into work every day and doing that every single day? And I mean, I, I know it's people do, um, but I'm sure that's why is it probably just saves Takes them time. time. Yeah. yeah, saves them time by not doing that. Well, it's full of cherries, but like I said, even if you don't get a bite of cherry, it's still, wow. <laughs> it, it's still very, very good vanilla ice cream. It's, Do you want to hold that up before I scoop it out? It's top notch vanilla ice cream. It, it's key That's lime. Heavy. I know. And it looks like they use a, like a graham cracker to like mimic a graham cracker crust. Yeah, I mean, that's heavier than the other one was. Yeah, it is. It's much heavier. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Whoop. I hope that graham cracker is what it looks like it is. Like I, do gritty, gritty. I do too. Gritty, sugary. I do too. I hope it's gritty too. I pretty much showed you, but that's what it looks like inside. You still get the graham all. I'm assuming that's graham all the way through it. Okay. And if you need more graham, I've got no, a huge chunk. Um, I'm just gonna try the ice cream first. They fill these up so full that you can't hardly push down on the lid or squish your stuff out. It's how full they are. But it's totally worth six ninety nine. Oh yeah, that is definitely graham and it's definitely sugary crystal. And the location that um, we go to is in Nicholasville, Kentucky. 
and they're so nice. They're very, very, very friendly. Very, very friendly um, group of people. They're very, mm -hmm. they're on it, doing, you know, working hard, getting it out to you as quick as they can. Very, very nice. If you've ever made a cheesecake or anything with a graham cracker crust, where you get the graham crackers and the butter and the sugar and it's pressed in there, if you've ever eaten a spoonful of them, that's what that is. Okay, I'm gonna get one right now. Oh, you haven't got any yeah. of it? That's the best part. They could literally give me anything with that gram in there and I think I'd like it. <laughs> a cup of that. Just that with the vanilla ice cream. It'd be fine. I'd be good. It'd be good to go. They could do that. They could do that graham cracker crust with vanilla. Mm -hmm. and it would still be, be really wonderful. Good. That's an excellent. Um, so what do you think of the actual key lime? The, the gram is my favorite part just mm -hmm. because I like that texture and the flavor. The, the key lime's good. At least it's not a sharp key lime. Mm-mm. No. It almost reminds you of lime sherbet. Yeah, well, no. It's not quite that sweet, is it? Or that? It, it's, it's a little more tart than that. Yeah. Um, I like I it quite a bit. It's not like that. I'm, I'm wrong. It's not a pure lime like that mm -hmm. is. Like a lime jello or anything like that. No, it doesn't have that much lime in it. As a matter of fact, it tastes more on the yogurt side to me. I could see that. Than it does on the... Like a key lime yogurt or lime yogurt? Yeah, it tastes like it has like a, you know, like the cheesecake has kind of a... Like a sour flavor? Kind of. That's what it tastes like a little bit. But I like it. I think it's nice. It's not a, um, it's not a hit of lime though. It's not really strong. Um, well. I can literally just pick all the graham cracker. Right oh, well, th there's a huge, huge so, hunk, but you can't eat it now because I got to get a picture of it. There's a huge hunk there and there's one in the middle. Because I have to show you how much you get. Okay, this is the you question, though. though. I would like that. I mean, I like it. It's, it's key lime, but it's, it's, it is really good. Uh -huh. But it's made really good by the graham. It's made really good by the graham. Oh, the you, graham cracker. okay. Yeah, I think if they didn't put the graham in it. I wouldn't like it. You wouldn't like it as much because you wouldn't be getting that whole, this is more like your key lime pie uh, slice because you're getting the graham. Uh, the, the, the key lime part isn't a, as strong as other key limes right. that we've had. Yeah, you so, don't get that sharpness from the key lime. Right, so it, it the graham really had something special to it. Yeah. Uh, but my question is, you only have money for one. Oh, I'm Bob Jerry for sure. Yeah, I mean, that's interesting as much as even, you like that yeah there's still not even any question about it i would still get uh i would too i would pick that cherry vanilla mm -hmm. but it's literally just no it uh, because uh, you kind of don't know what to expect when you when you're getting them it's literally vanilla ice cream With and cherries, they've yeah. added maraschino cherries to mm -hmm. it but it's wonderful yeah. the vanilla is so sweet and creamy and delicious it's just really terrific and i cream. like the texture of cherries anyway mm -hmm. i like that tough skin a little soft like fruity inside i like that so those are perfect for me and the, the fact that they are whole i really do like it that they're whole i even, do too even though slice them in half would have made them go farther and you would have yes. had more bites of it i like them that they're whole. i like them whole too i think it's awesome i mean you could always take your spoon and cut them in half while you're eating if you want you could, but I'm not I going to. Want, I'm I wouldn't do the it. whole thing in my mouth. Yeah, I wouldn't do it. I'm just saying you could. Right. Yeah, absolutely. But both of uh, them are good, though. And yes, and if if you haven't heard of Brewsters, uh, check out their website mm -hmm. and see if they have one a location near you. I think they have like over 200 locations. Yeah, like 22 so, different states. So yeah. So you everywhere. just need to look and see if you have a location near you. Definitely worth visiting. And yep. they have, like I said, like 24 rotating flavors to choose from. And you can order online and just pick it up through the drive thru And they don't have seating inside. We didn't. They don't. That. They don't. At least in our the two locations we've been to. Um, they, did of, have, they do have a drop there. They do have a drop there. But the other one is a window. You walk up to it, like a mm -hmm. rallies or something. You walk up to the window and you order and they give mm -hmm. it to you. Yeah. yeah. But I hope you all can visit them because they just They're have a good. lot to choose from. Uh, and I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.